actually here at the vegan hooligans and I'm so excited because I, I love their food like <laughs> let's just get that out of the way I had them last week at the Vegtoberfest I had the little melt and it was epic so of course I'm back for more food I want to order everything <laughs> everything on the menu so let's do that when I'm ready to eat. I've already been digging into the fries. Like, I just have to keep it real, you know? These are amazing. So these are the hooligan fries. They're like chili cheese goodness. There's like gravy, there's cheese, there's everything. Mm. Mm. Oh my God. Honestly, when the food got here, I was like, I'm gonna be messy. <laughs> I can just tell, like just looking at it, oh my god. And I'm okay with that, like that's totally fine with me. Like this is the kind of food you just have to dive in. Mm. Oh my god. By the way, this is like perfect weather for this. It's like so chilly outside. Mm. I don't even know how to dig in, like I'm trying to like... <laughs> I don't know how to like enter this. I don't even know, like... How do you eat this? Do you grab a fork? <laughs> I don't know. I guess people, <laughs> people who are like, you know, normal. Oh my God. This bite is gonna be epic. Watch. Oh my God. This is what I woke up for. Just plain and simple. I waited the whole day, my whole life, I wanna say. Get here and it was worth it like 100% like I would live everything I've been through give it to me again if it takes me to these fries mm. I literally have two more dishes that's just the first round but I don't know can't stop that's spicy yeah so I want to say there's like chili green onions cheese the gravy here um, and then there's like crinkly fries. I think they're crinkly fries. That's what they call. I don't know what this sauce is. It's like this. Oh wait, I think it's a chipotle mayo. Mm. It seems like I haven't eaten in like three years. <laughs> I can't. Now we have this adorable little hot dog. This is a hooligan dog, and it has bacon, chili. I see two kinds of cheeses. Maybe I'm insane. I see like a provolone and a, a yellow uh, yellow cheese. I don't know. I guess it's like American craft cheese. Obviously vegan, but you know what I mean. And then the sausage. And I'm ready. Like, I don't know. Why am I talking? I, I, somebody explain to me. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Let me get a fry because you know this, this is how I work here. Hot dog fry, hot dog fry. This is pretty epic, let me just say that. I don't know what kind of sausage they use, but it's delicious. Oh my god. I actually saw on their Instagram, like, they posted the hot dog with, like, mac and cheese. Oh my god. That looked amazing. Mm. Perfect weather, perfect food. I don't know. Cozy sweatshirt. That's part of it all, you know? What else do I want in life? I don't know. Okay. One more bite before I move on to the amazingness that's in front of me right now. If you're craving a chili dog, that's it. This is your spot, literally. You're done. No more searching. Chaser, you know, this is this is a chaser. Mm. 
This is a good day. So now life presents me with this. <laughs> I don't know how to tackle these obstacles. <laughs> um, manual would be appreciated. I don't really know how to tackle this situation here. I don't know how do you how do you overcome this? Ooh, this is a torta clearly. I have tomato, it looks like green peppers, avocado, oh guacamole, bacon, beans, there's also cheese, chipotle mayo, meat, everything. It's like that's it, you're done, you're packed for life. Now I don't know how to bite into this. This this is a considerable size. Like <laughs> I don't think you can tell in the camera, but let's go for it. Let's dive in. I don't know what else. Mm. Oh my god. Whoa. What just happened? <laughs> this is no joke torta. They don't play around here. <laughs> they, don't, they don't waste time here. Okay, I'm gonna attempt another bite of this monster. Seriously, it's so hard to bite into this. I don't know how to. Mm. Mm. Just a combination of things when it hits you. Oh, oh my god. Mm. The bolillo. Yes. Oh my god. The chipotle mayo gives it such a nice little kick, you know? Oh my god. There's food all over my face. I don't know. Amazing. So I also got this little shake. It's like chocolate cookies. Everything good in life. I don't even know. Amazing. And actually funny enough, it has bananas. I don't love bananas on milkshake, but actually this one's really good. And you can just dig in and eat the cookies. <laughs> I don't think that's how it's meant to be, but yeah. I make my own. They have a ton of milkshakes here. They have like Vanilla, strawberry, chocolate, all kinds. If you love milkshakes, this is your place. More food. <laughs> More food is here. So we have the street dog now. This one actually has bacon, peppers, onions. It has spicy mayo and also mustard. And actually it's super cheesy. Perfect. So let's go for it. Oh, and the bun looks so fluffy. Yeah. This is so good and like mm. the cheese is amazing. Mm. The sausage is actually amazing. I don't know what kind it is, but the flavor is not like overpowering. Like it's not sour crust. You know like that like German sausage has like really really strong flavor. This is like a different one. This is like your classic sausage. Oh my god. Amazing. Now we have the flaming melt. At Veg Store Fest, I had one of their melts and it was like, ugh, mind blowing. So let's try this one. This one has peppers, cheese. I think it also has that spicy mayo. I think maybe that's like a staple. Oh my god. It looks amazing. So let's go for it. Mm. Mm -hmm. The combination of things, just everything works. I was really disappointed. Epic. Like, when the sandwich falls, I pick it up. <laughs> and eat it. Now we have this classic, classic baby. Here we go. Like good old quesadilla. We all know what this is. Can't miss it. Like it's like I saw it. I already had it. The last time I was here, I had it. I was like, of course I'm gonna have it again. Like why wouldn't I ever have a quesadilla? I'm ready. This is just meat, peppers, onions, cheese, tortilla. Goodness. That's it. What else you need in life? Oh. <laughs> that's a quesadilla celebratory dance. That's how good it is. It makes you dance. That's it. I think this is a perfect quesadilla when you miss like cheese. There we go. This tastes exactly like cheese to be honest. Oh my god. Look at that. Gooey, melty. 
and I just love the meat that they use here. I don't know I again what kind it is exactly, but I'm gonna have another slice because this one has more meat. That that's my thing. It's based on the right to buy our I love when you bite into something and the flavors just keep coming at you. That's what's happening right now. Solid. So today I'm eating at an extremely fast pace. <laughs> I, I don't know, it looks like I, I, I came to eat. <laughs> Not playing around today. Solid food. I don't know if it's the weather. Maybe it's the weather. Like when it gets colder, I'm like, it's like hibernation mode. Like I, I feel like I need to eat <laughs> all the things. Maybe that's what it is. I don't, I don't know. This is pretty solid. Mm -hmm. This is a tortilla. It's like soft, but it's like crispy. Ugh. Okay, so we're not at the hooligans anymore. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> This already happened. We are actually at Yoga Erd one full ice cream later. <laughs> so I actually did my Spanish video and then I ate this over there. So if you want to check that out, make sure to watch my Spanish video. If you want to practice Spanish or you know anyone who wants to practice Spanish, that's a good way to do it. I came here for dessert because, you know. Mm. Okay. It had been a while since the last time I came to Yoga Earth. I was like, why not? <laughs> and this is the ice cream I always have. Like, I put it on my page. It's just a strawberry one with cookie crumbles, uh, wafer, cone, strawberries. The, yeah, I think I already said the strawberry ice cream. <laughs> Too much food for me today. No, that's, that's never a thing. Why am I even? And the hard shell, the magic shell, whatever it's called. The chocolate that, like, goes hard when you put... Uh, when you put it close to something cold. Mm. It's amazing. I've had this so many times. I always come back and I get the same. <laughs> I don't know. And of course, I also got a pie because one thing, when is that enough for me? Never. I got a chocolate ice cream pie. So again, I hadn't been here in such a long time that i didn't even know that now they make pies out of the ice cream so which is great because here they all they're always rotating the flavors so if you get this then it's perfect because like they make these and they put them on the fridge so let's say cookies and cream i don't think they've had it for a while but they still had this pie on the on the fridge on the freezer so this is perfect this is just kind of like um same it's just the ice cream but it's like in pie form and it has a little bit of a cookie on the bottom and then they put chocolate on top and cookie crumble Mm-hmm. Amazing. Before we go, let me just tell you that before going to the hooligans, I went to step puppies. There's actually a puppy that I'm like deadly in love with. I really want to adopt her. Like, I don't know if that's gonna be possible at all, probably not. <laughs> but I'm really in love with her and I wanted to see her and I was really sad because somebody's already fostering her. Um, I mean, I'm glad someone's fostering her. I just mean, I'm sad that I wasn't able to see her. And they told me like, if I want to see her now, I have to like coordinate with her foster. So that's like really sad for me because being a volunteer, like I go there all the time and I was really excited about the fact that I was going to get to like, you know, basically get to know her and always see her. Like just the way I see the other puppies. Yeah, every time I go, I see them and I'm like, for me, it's like I'm building a relationship with them. And I was excited to do the same with her and now she's gone. So I'm like really bummed about that. Um, but I don't know, I'm really in love with her. She's so adorable and she loves me. Like every time I would come, she would start crying for me. Anyways, hopefully I can show her to you guys at some point. But for now, here's a little clip of their beautiful little faces and you can see all the little chihuahuas. So she's a chihuahua and she came in with like seven or eight more chihuahuas that we rescued. So here's the little clip so you can see how cute they are. guys thank you so much for watching <sighs> I'm happy <laughs> what an epic ending to my video I just want to say I'm happy with life 
I don't know what else to say. Actually, I do. I want to I wanna give a little shout out to my brother, Taylor. He's amazing. I'm going to put his Instagram right here. But right now when I said, uh, I'm happy. <laughs> You have to go watch his videos. He's like a coach. He's amazing. He's like the number one best coach in Orange County. Check them out if you live there. Definitely be sure to find him. If you're like looking to, you know, get your fitness game on, look for him. But he's so motivational. His stories are so funny. And he's always like talking about like being positive and everything. And he makes me laugh because all his stories start with, ah, ah, <laughs> I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. <laughs> He's gonna crack up when he sees that. Hi, brother, I love you. Yeah, that's what I thought right now when I said I'm happy. <laughs> I thought about him, so shout out to you, my little brother, my big brother, my whatever brother you are, but you're my brother <laughs> and I love you. And that's it. So, all right, thank you guys so much for watching. Till next time, drink lots of water. Drink lots of water. That's rule of thumb, do it. And I'll see you next week.